people have have roots somehow often in the farm uh, whether it's whether they grew up there and left or whether their grandparents live there or whatever and they're and they're proud of of those roots I was born on a farm just south of Nelson in 1917. One of the best things about growing up on the, on the farm was the feeling of independence and closeness to nature. I always loved art, as, even as a very small child. I was taking a course from Char Charles Beck of Fergus Falls, and I did a woodcut. And after I had done the woodcut, I thought, well, that would be interesting to put that in a painting. And so that kind of was the beginning of the Calico country. Two things that people say about them, and I hear it over and over and over again. <laughs> One thing they say is they love the colors that I use. And another thing they say is that they're such happy paintings, they make them feel good. Sometimes they say, I'd like to live there. I want to move in over there. Well, I happen to like winter. A lot of people don't. But I like winter, and I love to paint winter scenes. I think um, that nice, white, clean snow and beautiful night skies and everything in the winter are beautiful. Uh, it was a man who came and looked at my things and, and said that I was a cross between Grant Wood, Courier Knives, and Grandma Moses. I think that was kind of a compliment. 